Today I'm going to unbox and review the OG Ambulance and here it is. Quite a big piece of play equipment if I show you both sides and um, there's one side and then the other side is open to allow for play. Um, first of all I'm going to show you all the working parts of it. So if we look at the front and I'm just going to tip it up a little so you can see. We have some buttons on top. One works the flashing lights. And then we have a button for the side. And the siren has two different noises. So you have the moving along and you have when it's stopped as well. So that's quite good. Now inside, there are more things that work. I'll just show you that the doors actually have a little catches for you to open them. But inside, we have a working car. But more fun, we have working windscreen wipers. And inside, you can't see this, but there's actually a sat nav that lights up. What's really clever is the accelerator pedal. Find it. Actually makes accelerating noises when you press it. Okay, so on the outside, we have the door that opens to let the doll in. And if I just bring it closer, you can see um, an awful lot of things come with this ambulance. And I'm going to unbox them for you now so that you can see what comes with it. I'll just show you the back doors. It's all very, very well decorated. Um, the tape shut at the front at the moment, but they do have little catches, so they do stay closed and then you have to open them. So there it is, there's the Our Generation Ambulance. So let's have a look at all the things that come with it. So you have um, a cupboard, an orange cupboard and a white cupboard. And then three little overhead cupboards, lots of storage. And this little glass cupboard that opens and these little doors that open here. I'm not sure if that comes out. No, it doesn't. The seat uh, moves forwards and backwards. And there you can see the buttons um, and the accelerator that makes the noise. The horn, which you press to beep. And we've got the windscreen wiper button there and the button for the lights. And there's the sat nav that lights up. So it's quite roomy inside. And there are the back doors, as you can see. And then let's have a look at all the things that we're going to put into these cupboards. So let's have a look at what comes with the ambulance. So the first thing I'm going to look at, we've got a ga um, an oxygen mask, and that will fit on the doll. And it plugs into the oxygen cylinder. And there it is. So that goes in the ambulance. Um, we have a little ear examining thing with the, it's got a little light on it. So you can actually see into the light. So you can probably see that that's lighting up the doll's face. So you can see into her ears. Let's just take your oxygen mask off. There we go. Um, similarly, we have a pen for looking into the patient's eyes. It lights up, if you can see that. So you can look into their eyes and check for concussion. Um, this is nice. Uh, we've got a neck brace. I'm not sure which way this goes on. I think it goes on this way. I'm not sure. But it does fit. So the neck brace goes on to stop them doing any further injury to their spine. Um, and then we have oh, 
we have a stethoscope and again everything really does fit the dolls really well so you can put it around the neck or it will go in the ears and stay there when you get it on there so you can listen to the heartbeat with the stethoscope um, oh these are really sweet we've got some plasters heart shaped ones and elastoplast shaped ones different skin tones for different dolls um, we have two sterile syringes and we have the vials that go with them somewhere here they are so we have vi little vials that go with them so you can do some vaccinations perhaps and um, we have the traffic cones for when the ambulance stops you get two of those and we have the other quite nice they're quite reflective just plastic cones this is nice we have the defibrillator and the paddles um, can be stored on the back so that you don't get them all in a tangle in the ambulance as you're driving along so just put those away Oops. and then on the front it tells you just like a real one has the instructions how to use it um, oh heart rate monitor um, these these kind of fit in on the little shelves in the ambulance so you can either have the defibrillator on the shelf as a little space for it or you can have the heart rate monitor and obviously it's got the paddles on the end these these come out so you could store them in a drawer in the ambulance so they don't get in a tangle oops um, this is quite sweet it's a little thermometer and it will actually go on the doll's finger it, it kind of opens like a little spring and it will it will grip on there it will normally it does grip on there um, oh, blood pressure monitor again oops so that velcro is onto the doll and then you can use the little bulb which is squeezy just like a real one ah these these I really like these are rubber gloves and they do actually fit on the doll's hands they're not made out of rubber they're made out they're sewn they're made out of nylon but they look like rubber gloves they flobble around like rubber gloves um, and they will actually go on the doll tried that earlier um, we've got some bandage scissors um, and some bandage and that velcros to itself so that you don't have to worry about how to fasten it onto the doll it just wraps around its elastic bandage just like the real thing um, sellotape for holding dressings in place there's the other syringe um, these are quite sweet we've got some chicken pot spots so you could stick some spots on the doll and make them look ill and then finally we have the blanket OG blanket and the stretcher which is here now the stretcher folds in half because it's actually too long for the ambulance but it's got little legs that come out underneath and that means that um, you can put the doll on it and she's not lying on the floor when she's on the stretcher there she is and now we can use the paddles and just check her heart rate or we could perhaps give her a bit of electricity to wake her up or even just check that she's not got a concussion and there you have it so some nice bits and pieces that come with it it's a shame that it doesn't have the gurney but that is sold separately um, I think it's out of stock in the UK at the moment but yeah very nice toy.